Dear brothers and sisters, in our catechesis on the virtues and the vices, we now center our attention on spiritual sadness. St. Paul speaks of a godly grief and a worldly grief. The former prompts conversion, enabling us to cling to hope and therefore leads to joy. The latter stems from dashed hopes and expectations, eroding the soul with discouragement and sadness. Unlike most vices that seek fleeting pleasures, sadness indulges itself by wallowing in sorrow, hindering spiritual growth. As an antidote to this kind of despondency, the Desert Fathers recommended embracing Christ's resurrection. For the risen Jesus redeems all the happiness that has remained unfulfilled in our lives. May faith cast out fear and Christ's resurrection remove sadness like the stone before his tomb. The Holy Father will now greet us in Italian. Do il benvenuto a tutti i pellegrini di lingua inglese, specialmente ai gruppi provenienti da Inghilterra, Danimarca, Malta, Stati Uniti. Su tutti voi e sulle vostre famiglie invoco la gioia e la pace del Signore nostro Gesù Cristo. Dio vi benedica. I extend a warm welcome to the English-speaking pilgrims and visitors taking part in today's audience, especially the groups from England, Denmark, Malta, and the United States of America. Upon all of you and upon your families, I invoke the joy and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ. God bless you. Domino Hobiscum, Signum in Domini Benedictum, et Eterno Nostro in Nomine Domini. Benedicat Vos, Omnipotent Deus, Pater, et Filius, et Spiritus Sanctus. Amen. 